Hi, my name is Alyssa Mulan, and I'm today going to talk about some benefits of using multimedia in the classroom. Um, while there are multiple definitions of multimedia out there, um, the Florida Center for Instructional Technology defines multimedia as the integration of text, graphics, animation, sound, and or video. Some benefits that I'm going to focus on today include engagement, interaction, and collaboration. Multimedia provides an easy way to improve interaction and engagement with students. Students working collaboratively on a project can have more benefits than we realize. They're learning how to work as a team and they learn new content and curriculum as well. Uh, multimedia helps students be engaged and when used appropriately, they might even forget that they are learning because they are having so much fun with the video and multimedia integration into the lesson. Uh, our text verbular from our textbooks Integrating Educational Technology into Teaching talks about both teachers and students creating videos in the classroom to explain a specific procedure or routine. Um, this can be viewed as many times as needed and can save time in the classroom. Uh, I personally can envision my second graders creating videos for our classroom routines as a fun beginning of the year activity to help uh, establish those routines. Um, also, the National Teacher Training Institute discusses the benefits of using video in the classroom. Um, it can reach children with a variety of learning styles, especially those visual learners. It engages students in problem-solving activities, and it can help develop those 21st century skills that our students need to know um, and to be able to use in their future. Um, this diagram just shows a quick 21st century learning skills. Um, number one, ways of thinking, two, ways of working, three, tools for working, and four, skills for living in the world. And you can see too there that the collaborative and problem solving is a big part of that um, as well. Um, videos can be used throughout any lesson. Um, it can be to preview, uh, to activate student schema um, and background knowledge at the beginning of a lesson. Um, it can also be used in the middle of a lesson to review concepts or of course at the end um, for any reinforcement or review of those concepts as well. Um, Discovery Ed is a tool that I use in my classroom a lot, um, they can also be great for discussions. Um, I use many of these videos from Discovery Ed that have discussion time built into the video. So students know when and what to discuss, and they also know when to stop as soon as the video resumes. So those are some ways that um, multimedia influences the classroom. So now I'll just talk a little bit about some examples of things that will integrate multimedia. Um, the first thing is virtual field trips. Um, that can allow students to have different experiences and communicate with people all around the world um, without even leaving the classroom. Um, another one can be students creating how-to videos. Um, students can create how-to videos from anything to a simple classroom procedure to explaining how to solve a math problem. Um, the students can assess, be assessed on their video and it can be shared with others who might be um, struggling with the same concept. Um, let's say if someone was struggling with two-digit addition, then um, they could watch one of their peer videos about that and um, be able to learn from it as well. So last, I just think that multimedia um, can be an engaging element to any lesson in any subject. Um, it's great for language practice, improving in the writing process, uh, reading strategies, the opportunities are really endless. So multimedia can also encourage students to become the creators in the classroom. Um, students using different types of multimedia to create new things 
and be creative with their learning is great. And it's also a great way for our teachers to be able to assess students learning in you know, a different and unique way. So ultimately, multimedia has the ability to do so much to any type of classroom. And it is teaching our students the skills that they need to know and that they will utilize later in their educational careers.